Hello everybody, it's Michelle here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for March 9th, 2024. Let me just see. Okay, sorry, they're already coming in with messages. Give me one second here. So we have 11 here. It's 47, but 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, <laughs> right? 11. The sacred pool. Um, To me, this is like connecting to a higher dimensional frequency, right? So this is what we get into when we meditate. If you really allow yourself to get into a theta brainwave state, this is a potential here, okay? And I was sort of allowing yourself to be bathed by this beautiful higher frequency and being able to connect with that. There's this beautiful light coming down and it's, it's coming down to her and she's just floating there. To me, this is such a sign to not be pushing on things, not trying to force things to happen and certainly not getting the ego consciousness to come in and, and craft this whole story because, you know, we, we get taught that all the power is in the mind and that's what I'm going to create for my mind, right? And that's true, but, you know, your heart has to play an equal part in that. You know what I'm saying? One, so you know, you know what kind of intention you're coming from. Two, so you actually know what's good for you to experience on your soul's contract and to keep, keep the emotion and the intellect balanced in your manifestations. You see what I'm saying? But reaching a place where I'm hearing disconnect. So some of you might be disconnecting. You're disconnecting from a fairy tale. And I got that because I just saw like uh, Cinderella's carriage. But it wasn't Cinderella's carriage. It wasn't like that. It was it was something along those lines. Waking up from this fairy tale and realizing you were so close. You were close to the energy you were trying to access. But the energy you were trying to access is divine love. Now, don't roll your eyes at that. That's what it's called, okay? <laughs> if you don't like the language, I don't know what to tell you, okay? That's what it's called. I didn't make the rules, okay? <laughs> but, but, you know, you're trying to access something through a dream state that is accessed through working on your receptors, yes? Divine love is always on offer. The issue comes when we are blocking it with worry, stress, judgment, anger, you know, all those lower frequency things. Everything kind of atrophies, <laughs> kind of atrophies. And then you can't absorb, you can't allow that to flow through you. And therefore you're not going to be a conduit for that divine love. So this is something to think about today and something to work on. So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.